What's going on guys, xfrodox 95 here. Today I'm bringing you some gameplay. We are playing some Domination on the map Mission. And um, uh, this is kind of like the first game after I decided I was going to do more of a variety of gameplay. I uh, decided to do some Domination. I've been playing a little bit of Demolition, you know, unsuccessfully. But um, I said in my previous video that I would start to play the objective more and I think I showed that a lot here I think I get like uh, six caps at least and I help spawn trap I defend a lot of flags so um, that's always good and I'm using the uh, M4A1 M4, is it just the M4? I think it's the M4A1 um, I guess it used to be the carbine and then um, so which I think is a very solid gun like in, in even in modern warfare 2 it was never a terrible gun it was never very powerful it was just a solid gun not too much recoil not too much power decent rate of fire everything was just solid about solid about it. it's like uh, i mean it's always usable it's a great gun for beginners and i would still recommend it in this game um just the recoil is a little bit weird and i don't i don't really trust the iron sights too much but uh, I was silencing it, so I kind of had to use the iron sights because I didn't unlock two attachment proficiency for it. Um, so those are my thoughts on the M4. I definitely would recommend it with red dot or silencer, like some sort of combination with that. And um, so I had one cap so far. Okay, so did I have two caps? No, yeah, I had two caps. So, um, yeah. <laughs> Um, the M4 is a very great gun. I, yeah, I would recommend it. And this map here, Mission, is a great, great, super de duper map. I would, uh, f <laughs> such a fail. <laughs> um, yeah, it's a great map. Um, I loved sniping on it before, but now that I started playing Domination, um, I love it even more because of how competitive the B flag is. And I don't know what that guy, that guy was on some, uh, the juiced. Death streak. That guy was on steroids. Jesus, He's running so fast. Um, but yeah, it's a great map. It's super balanced. Like, the only thing is, actually, it's not really balanced. The spawn trapping is a little bit ridiculous, but um, it's better than most maps. I would say this this game in general, Modern Warfare Three, and I would say that after like a month of playing this game, not a month of gameplay, but uh, a month of playing it. In, se in a bunch of sessions, uh, I would have to say that the spawns are really ridiculous in this game. I um, really, there's no way to tell where people spawn. Um, I still don't know the spawns. I don't know where. I know the beginning spawns, kind of, not even, and that's about it. Like Modern Warfare 2 and Black Ops, the most important thing in the game was that you knew the spawns. You know the spawns, you control the engagement. In this game, it's really random. You can spawn at one point. It's almost as if everyone is playing free-for-all. And if you guys have played free-for-all, you'll know that you can spawn next to an enemy at any f given second. It's really ridiculous. You will die and spawn with a gun in your asshole, out your stomach. It's ridiculous. But, um, so, since the spawns are so crazy, you can't really spawn trap people on Domination, which actually is kind of a good thing. Uh, Domination was kind of like notoriously known for its spawn trapping in Black Ops and Modern Warfare 2. But in this game, eh, there's not really much spawn trapping going on. I constantly find myself rotating around the map, you know, having A and B, then B and C, then A and C, and then rotating around the map because the spawns change pretty well. Um, and that benefits players in, to some extent, like uh, people who are not that great at playing are not constantly being raped in their spawns and people who are amazing at playing kind of suffer but there are other ways of making up for it if you play a very mobile and active role you will definitely get enough kills and a good enough score if you if you actively participate on the team and go where the opponents are and do a decent job of killing them um, so yeah that's my take on kind of like Modern Warfare 3 as a whole it's a it's a really it's, it's a very solid game, and I feel like because there's nothing wrong with it, it's not as fun 
as previous Call of Duties. I don't know why. I feel as if it's a super, it's a pretty balanced game besides the guns, but in terms of just like player skill, it's a much more balanced game because I noticed that my KD has been going down a lot since Black Ops, uh, uh, between this game and Black Ops and Modern Warfare 2, um, my KD is significantly less. Uh, because I feel as if it's much harder to dominate the games. Um, and one of the reasons is because of an update that was that happened recently. Uh, the creators of Modern Warfare 3 decided, uh, we don't like this hosting system. So they kind of got rid of the, uh, the advantage that hosts had before when they were playing. Previously, if you were the host, you were basically a mini juggernaut. And what I mean is... Things that happen to your screen happen a split second before everyone else. So if uh, opponents think that they shot you, they really didn't. They never even got close to you. They never even aimed down the sight. They never even saw you. You popped in and out of uh, a little corner, killed them, and they had no chance. You know. And now with the new hosting system, they have kind of reduced that lag. And I've, I've noticed that a lot recently. That um, gunfights are not as one-sided as they used to be. Before, if you were the better player, you will wreck. And if you were host, on top of that, there is no stopping you. You will get a 2KD every game. And that's not incredible, but to do it consistently is pretty dang hard, especially in this game. In this game, it's very hard to get a consistent KD, especially if you're playing the objective and that kind of stuff. Um, now, you'd think that in this game, it would be a lot easier to get killed... Uh, Oh, excuse me. It'd be a lot easier to get a better score because the kill streaks build up. It's if it's you just get your predator, your attack helicopter, your AH6, your Reaper, whatever you're going for. It's a lot simpler than in Black Ops, where if you wanted to get a, a decent kill streak, you pretty much had to go 8, 9, 11, which is pretty difficult to do. And in this game, it's it should be a lot easier but unfortunately the game is much more fast-paced action-packed things are happening happening you have to it's all reaction it's not like um, it's not skill it's whoever reacts first whoever wins the gunfights and that's why it was important in this game for in, uh, the creators of Modern Warfare 3 to change the host system because in a game like Modern Warfare 2 where the hosting system was kind of ridiculous uh, certain people would dominate and certain people wouldn't. And in this game, it's a lot more balanced. Like right there, I should have won that gunfight if I was host. I would have won both of those gunfights, probably. One at least. Unfortunately, well, not unfortunately, but um, it is what it is. Uh, Infinity Ward Activision, I think it's Infinity Ward, whatever. Infinity Ward decided to, or Activision decided to, what, I don't know, whatever. Um, they decided to change the hosting system and now it makes a for a much more balanced game where there isn't you know that one grizz just running around and wrecking little kids who are going home crying to their mommies and i don't know not studying i don't know i, I don't know what i'm talking about <laughs> I'm losing all the train of thought but um it's good in some ways it has it's po positive and negatives but uh ultimately it'll make for people it'll force people to get better at the game so that um they have they it'll it'll force them to become a lot better at the game so that they can dominate the game um and it's can't can't really explain what i mean but uh like right there if i was host i would have won both of those i got i would have gotten both those kills i was lucky that i pre-fired a little bit um <clears throat> but that's the only reason i got one of the kills so yeah if um I have no idea what I was talking about. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, so if you like this kind of gameplay where I play domination, that kind of stuff, play the objective, get decent scores, uh, comment, tell me what you think, what some suggestions on what I should do for more exciting gameplay. Um, please like the video. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and peace.